started out in California, it's California Bookstore Day. It worked so well that they made it national. This is the first year ever. Um, but it's just a way of sort of celebrating what we do and who we are and inviting people to come in and experience independent bookstores. It's an opportunity for all the bookstores who are in a sense, or you might imagine us being in competition with each other, and I guess in some sense we are, but it's, it's, a, it's a day for us to show, sort of show our solidarity. We have all this cool, these cool exclusive things to, to offer to customers. We'll do a lot of fun stuff um, in the store on the day. We serve our neighborhoods and it, it, it sort of brings us closer in a way. Um, you know, reminds everybody to support their local bookstore. So I'm launching my novel, The Blondes, at Book Court today. This is the first of several events, and it's one of the reasons I think that indie bookstores are so important, is because I'm going to five cities, and in all five cities that I'm going to, I'll be reading at independent bookstores. I, you know, try to remind everyone and myself that it's so easy to take independent bookstores for granted when you live in Brooklyn because, you know, there are so many great ones. People are really returning to independent bookstores and there's been a real resurgence in the past few years. And bookstores tend to have their own personalities. You know, they're quite different from each other, which, which is not the case so much with, you know, the big box stores. In Brooklyn, in, in sort of urban areas like this, we have really educated customers. People really care about the character of the neighborhoods that they live in. And they understand that shopping in a local independent store is part of how you retain that integrity and authenticity and the sort of particular flavor of your neighborhood. It's not just a place to buy books, it's a place to talk about books. For some people, literature is a, a social thing as well as, you know, an intellectual thing. And the things that bookstore staff do is they read your book and they recommend it and hand sell it to customers. And that's something that you just don't get anywhere else. We are so lucky to have staff that um, is fantastic. They are, our customers love our booksellers and our booksellers love our customers. It's almost like it's all a little family. Some of the challenges are, are more small business oriented than bookstore oriented. Constantly managing the inventory, you know, it's a, it's a fine balance between profitability and, and not. We have to figure out on our own what our customers are interested in. You know, we don't have a sort of corporate mandate. Um, you know, we don't have people doing a lot of sort of deep polling or, or, or sort of uh, sales analysis across the country about what we should stock. The curation of the books that we carry, sort of the, the choices that we make are very specifically based on what we see is working for our customers in our neighborhood. So people are going to come in and they're going to see things here on our shelves and on our display tables that they won't see in, in any other bookstore. Every day coming in and, and, and knowing that you're going to find out about something you had never heard of before and it's, it's thrilling, but it's also it's the biggest challenge of working here. It's a labor of love. We like to be the kind of store that can offer people books in whatever format works for them. We find that most of our customers do tend to prefer print, but there are definitely those readers who, who want to be able to have it digitally as well, so it's nice to be able to offer that. There's something very special about a physical book. You know, to me, a physical book is part of the story. You know, each book is different. You know, when I go home at night and I'm reading the book I'm reading, you know, I see it and, you know, I have a feeling about it. And, and it, you know, it's, it's jacket, it's pages, everything about it, you know, it has a different feel than the previous book I read. So, you know, there's something, there's something romantic, I guess, about the physical book. If you are really business-minded as well as passionate about opening a bookstore, it, it's absolutely a great business to be in. It's just a party, really. Is a party necessary? Who knows? But it's, it's something we're really excited about.